announcement has been made that I have been elected. The President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. This is a serious mandate. I hereby accept it. That mandate to serve you, be your servant not be your leader, to work with you and make Nigeria a great country. I take this opportunity also again to appeal to my fellow contestants to let us team up together. It is the only nation we have. It is one country that we must build together. We work together. To put broken pieces together, we must work for the unity happiness and harmony, we not, must not act like that orchestra that has no direction of a conductor. We will And we have elected a conductor named President Elect. Let's collaborate to create that symphony that will make the rhythm of music and prosperity and history for our country. We have what it takes. We have what is needed, knowledge, creativity, the mind, determination, we are the same country performing wonders in other countries. We can do it here. I promise I work with you to make Nigeria the destination of returning home to contribute to the day in Nigeria. represent that promise and with your support I know that promise will be fulfilled you will and we will achieve it together I commend my neck for running a credible election no matter what anybody says it is I never see any of you who did not make either arithmetic mistake or grammatical error in their classes, not to talk of the lapses, few lapses that were reported were relatively few in number and were immaterial to 
affair the final outcome of this election. Let's be realistic. But this is underlying report, reliable, yes. I say so, international community says so, and the arithmetic says so. With each cycle of elections, we steadily perfect the process so vital to our democratic life. Today, Nigeria stands tall as the giant of Africa. It shines even brighter as the continent's biggest democracy. You should be proud of that. Not just that our thing because you didn't win the election. You are a patriotic citizen. Be helpful to our integrity, character, and reputability to the development of our nation. Thank you. Thank you. The youth, I address you first. Let me repeat that I hear you loud and clear. What do I say? Loud and clear. Whatever the cause, we are going to chart the path together. We are going to embark on this journey together, united. No one is too small to be creative. Inshallah, we will work together. I will pay attention, undivided attention to your education. We will be creative. Credit will be available. Education loan will be available. Four years course will be four years course. No more strike. He was current vice president in my name. I got queries from everybody except my wife, but he did what he ought to do as a leader, reliable, dependable, and honest, honest human being. Thank you very much. Back to this page, to really thank you I say whether you are batified or articulated, obedient, quasia, or have any other political affiliation, you voted and struggled for a better Nigeria, more hopeful nation, and I thank you for your participation and dedication to our democracy. You decided to place your trust in the democratic vision of a Nigeria founded on a shared prosperity. 
and one nurtured by the ideas of unity, justice, peace, and tolerance. Renewed hope has dawned and landed in Nigeria. <laughs>